All right, this video is how to make the pump run a gray bar and what to check. So basically it's your main controller and this is your jockey pump controller. So the small controller is for the small pump, small pump right there. And the big controller is for this big pump, the main pump, which is the big controller. Right so to test it, all you have to do is you shut this off, right? So you shut this off so that way the small pump doesn't run because it's gonna try to keep up with the pressure so the main pump doesn't turn on. So you shut this off first, okay? You don't forget how to you know, turn it back on when you're done. Leave it off, and what you do is there, next to each panel, control panel, there's gonna be two valves with the pressure gauge. You see the pressure? You open this valve right here, okay? If you wanna check the jockey pump first, and you close it back up, but then you turn this off, and if you wanna turn the main pump off, uh, on, then you just, Open this valve, test valve. And the pump is gonna be running. There we go. Come back to the controller. You look here, and you see a button that says stop, right here. Okay, the pump stopped. Okay, that should give us a supervisor on the, on the main control panel. Okay, and you check inside. These are called packings. Okay, they have to have water dripping like that. Okay, because if not, the purpose of this drop is to lubricate inside uh, the packings. Okay, this is one side, and then the back side, same. Okay. So you check to have a, a little drop in there. If it's dry, uh, there's an issue. But that one has a little drop on it. I don't know if you can see it there, but there's a, there's a drop going in there. It's kind of dark. But yeah, anyway, so yeah. Then you come back here. You turn the jockey pump on, back on, okay? And if you want to test the jockey pump, then same thing. Open here. There's the jockey pump running. Shut it off, and that one will stop automatically. Just make sure you have it on, back on, okay? And that's basically it, you tag everything up, okay? And that's it, then there's another test you gotta do for pressure, and we're gonna go over that later, okay? That's gonna be a different different uh, type of a training, okay? But that's just for standard, you know, verifying that the pump is running. So if there's a fire, then the pump is gonna turn on. Okay, if it doesn't turn on during the testing, then that's, that's a big problem. It means that you're not going to have water in the system, enough water. Okay, and then your tampers and your flows and everything else you test. All the valves, you know, so 